about Will Smith, man. Uh, he was making the rounds the other day, talking about he is in the worst shape that he's ever been. And uh, we know this brother ain't depressed because uh, he kind of like, you know, works and operates in an alkaline energy space to where, like, you know, nothing could get Will Smith down away. He's just sitting there eating ding-dongs and, uh, you know, bonbons. Well, that's what it looks like he was doing. <laughs> okay, well, apparently he did it because he's working on a new YouTube original, him and Alicia Keys. Not together, but okay. separate. They're both getting their own shows. So Will Smith's going to be taking fans on a personal fitness journey where he challenges himself to tighten up every aspect of his health. And, of you know, course. if he would have started when he was, like, uh. in, like, you know, bad boys for life shape, they'd be like... Loser, you already got your shape. You know what I'm saying? So, like, now that he has uh-uh, something to lose. Uh-uh. I don't want to hear that. Oh, you gained weight during quarantine, <laughs> and now you need an excuse because you everybody say you got a dad bod. Because you, <laughs> when you look at fitness videos... You following the dude with the abs, you Billy Blank, whatever them people name is, because I don't watch, you know, yeah, the, the videos. I got a trainer. Shout out my trainer, Jason, the loft in uh-huh. Atlanta. Okay, but anyway, <laughs> so, but, so you want the people to be in shape. You don't want to see no dad bod working you out. You do, but you also don't mind seeing somebody who's down, down bad and figure out a way to get it back together. Yeah, in the back corner. <laughs> nah, like, I don't want to see him pass me twice. The, the I mean, guy in the front. Was, I'm, I'm already out of shape before. Now he's about to get out of shape and back in shape again. In front of you. I can't you. take that type of pressure in my life right now. <laughs> right. And he yeah. got trainers and people that could come cook for That's him. What I'm and... saying. Is he going to show us how to do it like what, if you're a the, regular person? the biggest thing, though. Like, you know, like the <laughs> diet is mostly in the kitchen. It's about what you eat. There's a lot of people who don't work out at all. Like, workout does accelerate your mm. results. But, yo, man, stop eating bread. Start there. Find out what your allergies are, like, internally. Not right. like I go outside, I hate pollen. But, like, people every day are eating things that they are allergic to, and it's That's making their too. bodies, like, inflame but, and, and but gut But some up. people cut out bread, and they still be, big, like, it's everything don't work for everybody. So It may not always be It's the top bread. ramen for me, y'all. <laughs> See, I ain't going to better stop doing that. Heavy on that the That macaroni cars. and cheese out the box. Heavy on the That's cars. part of my diet. My kids' diet. Are you nine? We stand behind it. <laughs> well, shout out to everybody out there who's uh, fuscular. That's fat and muscular at the same time. Because, like, you're working out, you're That's doing all the, the work, but you're still bloating out. I was having that problem for the longest time because I was still eating things that, like, my, mm. my intestines didn't like. And I had no idea. So, you know, you got to find out what you're allergic Just to. Just starve yourself. Nah, you know. Man, I'm built so like a lower-level drug dealer over here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm skinny, but ain't no muscle definition. <laughs> Welcome to the Carter, man. We're switching gears real quick, man. Um, You know, I always like when new bops come out, man, especially from, you know, my people in the Lone Star State. Now, Billy, I know we can connect on this. Dom Tolliver dropped a new single out of nowhere. Oh, Travis Scott been go. running it up for him. It's called What You Need. Yo, man, it's, it's very much the bop. Okay. <laughs> Come through with it, Dom Tolliver. Come hey, man, through with it, Dom Tolliver. Like that's, that, that, that's, that, that's that vibe. That's that summertime. We we snuck in the hotel to take pictures by the pool for their Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't even Molly and Zenex in their purse. You ain't even supposed to be at that hotel, but you did anyway. You, supposed, you ain't even checked in. You ain't got a room. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of also new releases, man, we We've been talking about, like, J. Cole, how he's expecting the fall off yes. to drop any day now. We do now have an official date. The off season is actually uh, going to be dropping 5-14. That's May 14th. So this week, which means Friday the 7th, is looking like it might be a TDE situation. We may get something, something from Kendrick Lamar. Hopefully, Did maybe you- it's a Scissor <laughs> album. I don't he know. said what Punch said. What he was like, that? stop trying to take my Instagram and turn it into everything. I, don't ask me about Scissor album. Don't ask me about Kendrick. I just tweeted. I posted. That's it. Okay, well. you posted the wait is over. <laughs> Gave us a date <laughs> and the loading bar. What do you want from what? the people, sir? Right. What do you want from the people? It's Isaiah Rashad. <laughs> and I'll take it. And Schoolboy Q, where he been? Uh, so, you know, he been out there thugging, probably getting his life together. I think it's going to be dope. Whatever he come with, it's going to be dope. But anyway, that's it for me. For some other stories I'm following. Twitter, Instagram, and SoundCloud, H-E-A-D-K-R-A-C-K. We are the morning hustle.